This weekend, no doubt, brought record rainfall throughout the county, with some areas seeing more than eight inches of water. Now, we have already surpassed our average rainfall with more than half of the monsoon to go. As of today, we've seen the wettest monsoon at this point in the season that we've ever had here in southern Arizona. And this last weekend helped push our yearly average rainfall to more than two inches over our average at this point in the year. Many locals made their way to the rivers, saying that this was one of the wettest weekends they've seen here. This past weekend brought nearly 10 inches of rain to Vail and just over 8 inches on Mount Lemmon and higher than average numbers throughout the rest of the area. Currently, this July is the fourth wettest July on record. With just under a week remaining this month, could we expect to push further up that list? to be thrown in the trash, huh? I mean, in the in the hamper. <laughs> What's the big deal, dude? What's up, everyone? Welcome to another vlog. Yeah, welcome to another vlog. Can you tell everyone what's happening? What? It's raining. Oh, your boogers. Tell everybody what's happening. Tell them. What do you see? Rain. Don't go out there. It's cold. It's very cold. Papa, is it raining? Welcome back to another video. Um, remember I mentioned that it had been raining a lot well it's still raining and so much so that all of the hey jojo get over here she's like running out in the rain and it's a little chilly all of the washes and streams and rivers and anything that is meant for water to be is always dry are they're now like fully running washes rivers and streams like it's so weird so the kids wanted to drive around to see more water and we were just driving around in the rain let me see but let me show you what the backyard looks like because it is pretty here you go it is like raining a lot and it will not stop i'm pretty sure it's supposed to keep raining all day today what baby are you taking pictures of all of this All done? You can put them up there, bud. Yeah, put them up there. Yeah. Or on the table. Go ahead and put them on the table. You can put them on the table. Alex's water. Where's her water? Where's hers? I won't actually run out there because then the kids are just gonna follow me, but the back of the yard is pretty much flooding. Oh. Alex, you see all the water? Raining. It's raining, yeah. Here, I'll take it. I'll take it from you. Thank you, Papa. Let's put this up right here. All right. You can walk out there. It's raining. Here, let me turn on this light. You see all the rain? Alex, leave that alone. It's raining. It's wet everywhere, huh? Papa, you wanna walk out there? 
Yeah. I'll go with you. Well. Oh, you want to walk out there? Okay, let's go walk out there. Are you gonna walk? You're gonna walk too. Okay. Are you gonna walk out there? Okay. Go ahead, Alex. Go ahead. Oh, it's gonna get wet. Oh, Jojo, it's wet. It's cold. No, Jojo, come back. <laughs> it's too cold, Jojo. It's cold. Is it cold? No, Jojo. It's cold. No, Alex. <laughs> it's cold, huh? Helicopter. Helicopter. Get over here. You're going to get cold. <laughs> Papa, you want to come out here? No? Okay. That's fair. Throw it! Yeah! Mister, what do you think about all this rain? Let me see. There you go. Rain. Yeah, he likes the rain, you think? Yeah. Yeah? <laughs> gentle with Mister, be gentle. So pretty much like the snow days that we had, these rainy days only happen um, around like a certain part of the year. This is the time, we call it monsoon season. Um, but the last few that we've had have been fairly dry. Last year, I don't remember being caught in the rain, like at all. Um, and then it randomly rains, you know, here and there throughout the year. But this is normally the time that we get rain, so it's not completely unexpected. But at the same time, I haven't seen this much rain here in a long, long time. So everybody is amazed. If you drive past all the washes and all of the things that we've seen, people are pulled over, they're recording, they're taking pictures, because it's just something that you, you don't see that often, even though we get rain, because we're in the desert. The ground sucks it up almost immediately so nothing actually sits for a while so now we have like flood warnings and you know everybody needs to stay inside we have roads closed it's just it's bad all throughout town so um here's a video of a street pretty common and popular street we used to drive through all the time it's right by the gym that we go to um, but i'm just going to show you what the street looks like right now it's insane the street's closed. Obviously, you, there's no way you could drive a vehicle through this. Um, so here's that. So crazy, right? I was like... I haven't seen this in so long, if ever, I right hear. It's raining? Are you taking pictures of all the rain? Yeah, huh? Jojo, what are you doing, Jojo? Are you taking pictures? Here. <laughs> hey, Papa. <laughs> Mommy. Oh, bunk. Bunk. Oh, Alex, bunk. Oh, girl. Oh. <laughs> Cheese. Cheese. Uh oh, broke. Oh, let's turn it on. There you go. Mama, um, um. That doesn't turn on. It's a ball. Put your chair on. Put it on, put it on, put it on. Yeah. Mm, I don't know if we mentioned this, but our next door neighbors um, over to this side, they're... 
me see. Let me see. They're, they decided to move back um, where they're from, so they're moving out of state. And so within the last month or so, they've been just giving us a bunch of stuff that they don't want to sell or just don't have the time to, to sell. So they've been giving us a ton of stuff. Um, which is pretty awesome because it's stuff that maybe we needed or we were trying to buy or just stuff that we can kind of, all right, do we like this better than what we have? And if not, you know, get rid of the other stuff. But we also donate a lot of stuff to the daycare because we love them and what they stand for and um, the owner is amazing. So, and the staff, our kids love everybody there. So donate everything and anything that we can that they may want and of course we got a ton of toys because they have a little girl also next door and so this is all the stuff that they've been playing with um, it's all stuff that they've given us so the little couch all of these little toys the little camera she's playing with the balls um, and they're just having a blast I mean everything down to the laundry basket so this has just become their downstairs toys now. And they have quite a bit of other stuff that they had gotten that they already took upstairs with them. Mister apparently has something stuck under here. He wants me to get him. Oh, yep, I see a ball down there. Ugh. This guy, Mister? Yeah? Cold. Cold water? Yeah. Babe, when's the last time you've seen rain like this here? I, I don't even know. If ever, right? I've seen it. I just, it's been a long, 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 long time. Oh, he's finally building up the courage to go out? Nope. He hasn't stepped out. Is <laughs> yeah, he cool? Oh, good throw. Catch it, catch it. Yay! Try again, try again. In the laundry basket. Oh, Alex, Alex, what are you doing in there? What's up, dude? Mama, Mama, Mama. It's cheese. Ready? Woohoo! Um, like this, look at. Push this button right here. There you go. There you go. So, after we put the kids down for a nap, um, we, well, we noticed there was a puddle on the side of our house and it looked like it was getting worse and worse with all this rain so Candace and I decided to build a trench because it was actually really really um, deep of a puddle and the water had to have been at least above my ankle um, so what we did is we literally grabbed the shovel and the hoe that we had and built a little trench all the way down. Water's still kind of sitting right here, but we built one all the way down to get the water to drain because the water was coming up pretty close to our foundation, which obviously is not good. We don't want water sitting on our foundation because it'll start to crack. And so we built a little trench all the way down To where the yard is supposed to braid it's supposed to do this on its own but it didn't and the water has slowly started to spill all the way out where it's supposed to end up which is a wash but it was really bad and it's almost like the um it's just something they messed up on when they when they did the the grading for the yard when they built the house but notice how this side kind of goes this way so it all lands on the side of our house and rather than draining this way it just kind of sat there 
So now with that trench, hopefully this will continue to slowly go down and make its way down here. Look at this, all this water is coming from our yard. All these little cracks flowing from all the water that was stuck on the side of our yard, so. And I don't know if you can tell where the waves are going, but they literally flow all the way down to that wash. So yeah, that was fun. Now my feet are soaked and I'm soaked. <laughs> but at least this is done.